Hey everyone, here in San Francisco at Land's End, which is essentially the northwestern point of San Francisco, pretty close to the Golden Gate Bridge. Uh, we're just here, uh, me and my girl, and uh, for a couple of days we're about to head out and we just decided to come out over here. You can see the ocean behind me. You can hear the ocean, it's pretty, pretty nice. Um, and something I just noticed about San Francisco, which was something I already do a while back, which was there's so much stuff to do just for regular people. You don't have to be rich. I mean, it is an expensive city, but you don't have to be a rich person to enjoy what's available here. We've got these parks, there's a bunch of parks, there's a bunch of stuff um, that's just for everybody. You, know, you walk around a lot, there's all this scenery, there's an ocean, there's this place right here. We didn't pay, we just parked and we're here now just uh, kicking back you know so it's pretty cool it's pretty cool um, and uh, something I noticed years ago when I was here I was living here shortly for summer um, I noticed that I had gotten healthier I just felt better and it was just something simple it's just clean air the air is just really fresh crisp and nice and has a, has a unique quality and you also have um, all the walking that you're forced to do, you know, whether you're going kind of at a high, you know steep angle or you're just going at these more you know gradual angles, you know, you'll you notice that um, your body just gets healthier, your legs get stronger, your breathing improves. Um, just my back pain, you know, it's just kind of not really there um, from all this walking. So it's really cool. It's a really beautiful place. Land's End, I don't know much about it, but I mean, I just, uh, as far as history, maybe there's some kind of historical thing. I don't, there's a lot of military, um, areas that basically decommissioned or whatever and turned into public spaces. Um, we're basically staying pretty close to, um, Golden, uh, Gate Park. And that is just a beautiful park. I mean, it's just so much going on. People are happy. Pretty exciting, you know, pretty neat environment, you know. The sun right there. You can hear the ocean in the background, very cool. selfies over there of course guess I'm doing my version of the selfie here how you doing babe hard at work like me Say? I love these trees. I don't know what these are, but they're really cool. Very cool. We're at Land's End over here, and it is just gorgeous. You can hear the ocean in the background. It's like this kind of almost like a hum. Uh, pretty intense waves out there. I mean, it's not that crazy intense, but they're pretty big nice these old trees up here and one thing I got to say and I've been saying this for a long time um, the place you live in has such a big uh, makes such a big impact on your quality of health and um, there we go that's a little bit better um, your quality of health it's, it's a big deal it's a big deal and the reason it's a big deal is because, like for example in San Francisco, you're forced to walk around a lot. But it's not like you're forced to walk around a lot and it sucks. It's a beautiful place. So it's like, hey, you want to walk around a lot. Like here, we just parked. 
we're going to the beach right now and it's not just some crappy old beach it's nice there's these old trees here there's people the people are fairly friendly um it's just a neat place you know it's very artistic it opens up your heart um I feel better just from all the walking. Where we're staying at, we rented a place from Airbnb for a couple nights. And um, the place we're staying at is right next to Golden Gate Park. And it's just this long, it's like almost half the length of San Francisco itself. It's this giant park with these old trees and all this cool stuff to do in there. And, and uh, I don't really like attractions and things like that myself, but there's... Um, what do you call it? Uh, lots of places to go biking and walking and trees and places to go and be by yourself. It's just a lot of people there, but there's also a lot of space. So, feel for that right there. It's the ocean back there, but you kind of can't see because of the. We'll get it lower down. You can see the ocean better. the background let's go darker let's see the ocean better here in San Francisco um, there's just this feeling of um, just public spaces and moving around and biking and um, I just feel better in a lot of ways it's just the air is clean anywhere you're in San Francisco the air is clean how cool is that eh, it's, it's amazing it's great LA not really unless you live by the beach this whole place is by the beach. Let's check it out. Hey everyone. Hey. Me and Sona, we're just hanging out at Ends Beach. Or Ben's. Land's End. Land's End. <laughs> Land's <Bend. laughs> well, Let's get a view, let's turn around. Let's get a view of this place over here. What do you think of this place, Ben? It's really nice. I love it. It looks like the end of the world and really beautiful. Like end of the world in a bad way or a good way? No, and, and <laughs> kind of sounds like it's bad, but actually it's a really cool place to come to visit. The lands, the end yeah. of land. And it's good for like San Francisco residents. They, they, <laughs> like they can come and then do exercise, you know. It's like a yeah. really healthy life, lifestyle in San Francisco. Yeah, that's what I think too. I think it's a cool place if you live out here. You just come and just chill, get some fresh air. That's the one thing I noticed. A lot of fresh air here. Yeah. And um, food's expensive as hell over here. Even at a regular market. Yeah. Not even getting anything organic or whatever. It's super expensive. But. Um, in the same time, it's worth it to live. But it might be worth it because you're probably going to live longer if you live in a place that has not just places like this, it's kind of touristy, but. It's a great place just to go for a hike up here. If you look behind me, you can just hike up here and just walk. And you're always kind of being forced to go up and down hills. Yeah. And um, they have so many places to go, like cool activity. You know? Yeah, and you don't have to really pay money for it. No. But the rent is expensive and um, the food's expensive. But hey, it's worth it. You know, it's yeah. got to live, and might as well live in a place that's just the bomb like this. Look at this. Yeah. this is just Really amazing place. Yeah. It's a good place to meditate too. <laughs> That's right, and meditating. <laughs> Don't forget to do that. <laughs> hey, so we're in the other part of here, the park at Land's End, and we're just kicking back, looking at all these trees. Let me see if we can get a nice wide angle got people it's a very touristy area I guess we're tourists too so that is kind of normal but I was just thinking how cool it is just if you come here like 
once or twice a week, you probably just live longer because it's just so damn healing. I mean, look at this place. What do you think, babe? It is, right? It's just beautiful. You got this canopy going I on here. I can't describe enough. You get the sunlight, <laughs> you get everything going. Got the air. Got the birds. Got it all. If I leave there, I would come here every day. I feel like I'm I get sick of it after every day, but no, I don't think so. No, it's increased my age like 10 years younger. Oh, you live like, <laughs> yeah, like, like I live. Who needs a facelift? Why could you just come over here <laughs> and then go eat hamburgers afterwards, right? <laughs> no, but if you have a good, healthy lifestyle, like juicing and doing all that stuff, ozone, you know, and coffee enemas and all that stuff, you're gonna live at least 15 days longer. In your whole lifespan. No, you'll live definitely longer and healthier and feel better. I mean, this is just like, if you want good hormones running through your body, this is the place to come. You just feel joyful and peaceful and rested and calm, right? It just slows everything down in a good way, but not too slow. And you know, like when you're in class, everything meditate. slows down, but that's not good. Maybe. You're ready to meditate? Yeah, I'm ready. Right, nice, nice. Like, I get a good spot. Right that's here. your meditation like, like, stand? Where, where are you? There you are. She found a spot to meditate right here. <laughs> I'm ready to meditate. <laughs> meditate. So yeah. I don't, I don't know what kind of trees these are, but if anybody knows, put a comment on there. That'd be tight. I want to know what these trees are. Maybe I should just research on the internet, but why would I want to do that? Anyway, come to places like San Francisco if you want to oh, live sorry. longer. I'm pretty sure you would. Unless yeah. you eat a lot of hamburgers and pizza, which <laughs> a lot of people do, so don't do that. Look at that dog, it's so cute. Said, that was a, one of the cutest I mean, dogs no, I've ever seen. That doesn't work. In history. Oh. <laughs> in history. Okay, I'm just gonna tell you. It's I think they have like the cutest dogs on this trail. <laughs> Seriously. And so, anyway, so it's, it's just quite the place. I don't want to go back home. So, okay, so for anybody that was curious again, it's called Land's End, San Francisco. It's the end of the world. I wouldn't quite oh, put I, it I mean, that way, not, but... No, 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 not actually. It's <laughs> not the end of the world, it's just Land's End. <laughs> just the end of the land. <laughs> Sorry. No. 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 Don't end yet. No, here we go, more views. I mean, it's a little selfish, but I wish I had just a house over here and just all mine. Greedy. The greedy me. Selfish me. Own the whole San Francisco, huh? Yeah, the whole San Francisco. <laughs> no, just this one area. I don't need everything. There we go. Let's get a view over here, man. That's nice. And then Golden Gate Park. That's pretty amazing, too. Getting a picture of it. We got these trails going up. They're not too hard to do, it's really, like, really easy. This is like, you could bring grandma along on this um, tourist attraction. Well, not my grandma, but older people can easily do this. going up over here. I don't know. Maybe they planted seeds. Oh yeah, yeah. Sometimes they put certain type of seed or certain type of plants. Those little red tags on the ground. I don't know if you can see them. It's like conservation. It's good. We should take care of what's here and you know make sure they don't get messed up. Those trees? Just a second. Yeah. Look at these cute dogs. You don't see any cats on this trail. I'm not surprised. Cats are nice. Oh my gosh. I wonder where Golden Gate is. Oh, there it is. My goodness. Look at that. Look at that. It's 
quite the sight. Good old Golden Gate Bridge. Human engineering at maybe its best, but I'm not sure. Maybe I'm just overdoing it on that. It's pretty damn cool. What a cool place.